Good, Good morning, morning Colts. Colts. I'm Noah. And I'm Asher, and this is KTV for Wednesday, March 16th, 2022. Hey Noah, let's start off this video with an announcement from the library. Make sure to get your overdue library books returned so other students may enjoy them. Also, please bring your student ID card to check out the items from the library. They can scan the barcode to serve more quickly and efficiently. Hey Asher, I have a quick question. Has your Chromebook been acting up lately? Mine has and I'm not sure what to do. Well, Noah, you can fill out a tech ticket to get your Chromebook ready for school. Let's hear more information with a video from Lila. Colts, a lot of us have annoying tech issues with our Chromebook that we wish we could fix. So look no further. On the KJHS website, go to the student page and you'll find a tech repair page. On the page, you'll find an email for helpdesk at pecky12.org and you can send an email for tech help. Include your name, ID number, school, contact information, and description of the issue. You'll be contacted as soon as possible on instructions to have the issue fixed or if it needs to be swapped out. Hey, my Chromebook is fixed! Make sure to get yours fixed too! Thanks Lila for helping me out. I know a lot more now and can finally be able to fix and prepare my Chromebook for the next day of school. We should consider being empathetic towards others by helping them out with their Chromebook issues. Let's learn more about empathy with a video from Neha. Hey Colts, you've learned a lot about other life skills already, but now let's learn about empathy. Empathy is the ability to understand and share the feelings of someone else, see things from their point of view, and imagine yourself in their situation. Empathy can help you build better friendships and connections with other people. To practice empathy, you can ask questions sensitively, acknowledge your biases, and listen intently. Empathy is important to have because it improves our social connections by helping us respond to situations in the best way we can. Be sure to practice your empathy daily, Colts. Uh, I will try to be more empathetic now towards others. Just like how we should be understanding if the lunch menu changes depending on what we have available. Today on the lunch menu, we have hamburgers, Domino's smart slice, cheese pizzas, spaghetti and meat sauce, and turkey ham and cheese sandwiches. I was hoping the weather was cloudy with a chance of meatballs, but I guess it's just raining. There will still be a 50% chance. Let's go and figure out more information on the weather with this week with Sophia. Hey Colts, welcome to the weather studio. Today will be sunny with a high 66 and a low 42. Tomorrow on St. Patrick's Day, it will be partly cloudy with a high 62 and a low 39. On Friday, it will also be partly cloudy with a high 64 and a low 42. In other news, on this day in history, a violent tornado lifted one-fourth mile long Steel Route 16 bridge and threw it into Greer's Ferry Lake in Arkansas. Now for a joke, where do leprechauns live? In leprechondos. That's all for weather colts. Now back to Noah and Asher in the KTV studio. Hey Asher, do you know anyone in the Pride Club? Because if you do, they're having a meeting on Wednesday at lunch in room 29 to watch videos about inclusion and compassion. You know Colts, you can go with either your club members or friends to the Decades Dance. Wednesday Decades Dance tickets are on sale at the leadership window at lunch. Cost is $3 with the Colt card and $4 without, plus your signed permission slip. On Thursday, the price goes up to $5 for all tickets, and no tickets will be sold on Friday. Don't miss out on Decade Fun. I myself am wondering what to wear for Decades Days this week and to the dance, but luckily there's a video to show us some ideas. I heard the wrestling club recently had a tournament. Maybe sports will have some announcements about that. I'd like to hear more about that, this in the sports corner. Let's go to the sports corner with Gavin. Hey Colts, welcome to the sports corner. This past Saturday, Kenworth Junior High competed in the North Valley League competition. 
championship tournament at Hillsburg High School. The Colts finished an amazing third place out of 12 teams while forfeiting four weight classes. The Colts finished with four league championship champions in the varsity and JV competition. Seventh graders Ali White and Luella Polito winning their respective weight classes and eighth grader Nathan Sledetal and Caleb Gantua took home gold as well. Other medal winners include eighth grader Ibeth Rivera claiming silver in her weight class. Kenilworth came back strong in the consolation round and took home medals with a strong performance from 8th graders Ronan Hurley, Anthony McGahey, Jonathan Podelli, uh, Christian Torres, and Joe Dino. 7th graders Jamie Parker won bronze with JV competition Why? while Aiden Cobell and Jack Laughling medaled in the varsity championship competition. The Colts also had several 4th place and 5th place winners with 7th grader Logan Norman taking home copper and varsity 105 weight pound weight class. Great job, Colts. Now back to Asher and Noah in the KTV studio. Actually, now that I think about it, Noah, do you have a role model for writing? Not particularly, but Gloria Steinem is, was great. Let's watch a video about Gloria Steinem from Chance. That's all for today, Colts. Make sure to remember that the dance is this Friday. And, and that's, that's KTV. KTV.